Hey guys, how are you doing? Mila san konnichiwa. My name is Tisa and welcome to my channel. Today I'll be reacting to Burning Girl Senpai episode 9. Alright, so we wrapped up the whole part with Taba. I really really enjoyed her story as well and how they dealt with her problem. She's now back to 1. So everything is fine. And now we're shifting our focus to different characters once again. And we're focusing right now on this idol. I'm not even sure what her name is, but we kind of saw at the end of the previous episode how she woke up and something was wrong. So we'll see what that's about in this episode probably. So I'm curious to find out what it is. So yeah, without further ado, let's get right into the episode. So let's go. I'm ready, so I'm gonna the episode in three, two, one, go. September 1st. Right, I have to keep it a secret. Oh, she looks so cute in that outfit. She's not there. There she is. <laughs> a pure innocent relationship. Oh, they switched bodies. All right, that's clearly my. <laughs> Another type of adolescent syndrome. <laughs> He's like, again, here we go again. <laughs> I feel like he's getting tired of it, right? But at the same time, he might be getting used to it as well. It's like, okay, it's the same thing, here we go. <laughs> But it's interesting, like, we don't even know this new girl yet that well. Like, we saw her for the first time, like, last episode or something. Mr. Panic. Oh, all right, she bought that whole place. Oh, they actually sisters. Or like half sisters, okay. 
and they're both in the showbiz. <laughs> it's weird to see my acting the same way but in a different body. so hard it's suddenly living like someone else <laughs> He's like, yeah, we don't need you anymore, you can leave. I see. that might play a role as well into why they switch bodies but it's weird it's super confusing like I have to keep reminding me that they actually switch bodies so the one he's talking to is actually Nodoka right and the other way around as well Just something else, but she made like cup noodles <laughs> with water she heated in this slip. Yeah, well, how do you call that? The cup. Oh, 
一言で言えばよくできたお前のコンプレックスだなそれはそんなもんどうやって隠してくれたらいいんだ一緒に遊びアイドルにでもなればいいんだよ、ね、That's easier said than done though Like how do you become nationally popular? A different girl once again sleeping at this place. Oh, she's right there. She's being honest. said because of their parents that they can't get along with each other they kind of set them up against each other because of their own selfish reasons because at that age you really want your parents approval right like you're you really want to make them proud in some ways so i i, I really understand but it's still sad She's like, again, again, a different girl in the house. <laughs> That's actually myself, though. Sister in law, <laughs> exactly. 
分ぐっすりだからね。私のことでも考えてた。マイさんのことなら常に考えてます。そうよね。本当は昆虫天国に夢中になってただけです。<笑>あれ？どんな遊びか知ってます？ Oh my god, no, why did I, why did I picture it? Oh man, dirty me. Mama, I'm a kid, I'm a kid. 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 Living the lives of the other. Doing the interviews, the dancing and singing practices. The live gigs. Well, I think they're doing quite fine actually. But I think it will be bad if they start getting used to it, you know. Getting used to living as someone else. Makinohara san wa omae san ni nan da to ne. Hai, toriko ko desu kara. Demo tokidoki akogaretari wa shimasu. Sutsu na omae san ni ita ra okute. It's already September 10th, so we're 10 days have passed already, and nothing has changed yet. I like it that they're still friends, you know? Wow, she's spamming her with all these messages! Oh, it's already making me hungry. Number twelve. <laughs> okay. He's casually walking by the set so they're filming it. Or was that really a coincidence? Oh, she's super nervous. No, she 
is hyperventilating. Yeah. It must have been so nerve wracking for her. It was something she's not used to, you know? Girlfriend. I still don't like her, by the way, but that aside. Exactly, especially when it comes to family, siblings. <laughs> That's definitely what he's gonna do. First thing, first thing he enters, he's gonna open the cabins. Is he gonna do it? And of course they ended there! Alright.
Nodokai. This time it's with Nodoka in the ending. I like how they keep changing it, you know? Alright, so that was episode 9 of Bunny Girl Senpai and we started this new chapter, we're now focusing on Nodoka and Mai, it turned out they're half-sisters, both in the showbiz and it's mainly due to their parents actually, that they turn into this whole rival thing, you know? So yeah, as I've said before, it is just unfortunate because they actually really care about each other, even though they say that they hate each other, it's basically because of the position they're put into by the parents you know like just when you look at their pure at their personalities without the whole position in the showbiz they actually really like each other especially Nodaka she really looks up to Mai as her older sister it is just sad to see that they can be really honest about it because of their positions you know Nodaka has this whole inferiority complex towards Mai as well because Mai can do everything better than her and then her mom keeps like nagging about it like you see Mai can do all of this why can't you do it I, I hate it I hate when parents compare their children to others you know they're different people like they have different capabilities they have different things they're good at you know why keep comparing I think if I remember correctly, I'm not really sure. I think my parents used to be like that as well. They kept comparing me to others, especially when it came to sports. You know, I used to be, I used to be an athlete. I did a lot of sports when I was younger, and I did it on a high level as well. But at that time, like my parents kept comparing me to the results of my rivals and and others. It made me feel very uncomfortable. You know. And it also made me very insecure at times as well. I, like I felt like I wasn't good enough, and I couldn't make them proud of me. So, so I understand where Nodoka is coming from, but it still sucks. And I don't know. I feel like a lot of parents are like that for some reason. They want their children to be the best, to make themselves look good. But they just put so much pressure on the children. Honestly, if I ever get children and I become a mom like that, that puts so much pressure on the children and cannot be proud of her just because she cannot achieve the same things as someone else, I want someone to slap me and say like, stop doing what you're doing. Like, this is not good for your child. It is really toxic for children to have like, parents having so high expectations of you. And as children, you cannot help but think like, oh, I need to make them proud. I need to do my best to have the, my parents acknowledge me. But as you grow older, such worries start to disappear. And you'll realize that making your parents acknowledge you is not the most important thing in the world. You know, What's, what matters most is you having acknowledging yourself and accepting what you can do, what you cannot do as well. Like acknowledging that that's much more important and that's something you realize as you grow older but especially when you're at that age you're still in high school you you cannot see it that way yet at least i couldn't when i was at that age so i don't know i think this whole situation is very unfortunate like you can see that between my and Nodoka, they're just sisters, you know, and I like when they said like siblings isn't about liking or hating each other You're just family. It doesn't it it's much more than that And I feel like I've heard that recently in a different anime as well But it is true like I have two younger brothers myself So I understand, you know, like we have a good relationship like we don't fight we don't actually fight at all but we also give each other space and we don't really hang out with each other much either. So it's not like we l really like each other, but we don't hate each other at all either. It's just, we're just 
there's just this connection that you can't get rid of and that's what family is about it's not about liking or hating each other it's different from friends you know like friends are the family that you choose different from the family that you already have but i guess in their case in my and Nodoka's case it's a bit more complicated than that because they're also half sisters so it's a family they gained later on in life and there's not much age difference between them either but you can still see that Nodoka really respects Mai and really sees her as better than herself you know and that's why she also felt that much more pressure when she was shooting that commercial because she felt like she has to be as good as Mai herself that she really admired so that's why she felt super nervous and hyperventilated but I kind of get it it's just hard acting as someone else you know living the life of someone else being like you're someone else acting like you're someone else it's so hard I would I was thinking and I was like if I were to put in someone else's body would I be able to do it probably not and I'm just afraid that they'll start to get used to it you know eventually because how much time has already passed since they switched bodies like like almost two weeks right like it's a long time being in someone else's body and living in someone else's life i'm just concerned that they might get used to it eventually and that's probably the opposite of what they should be doing to turn everything back to normal but we'll see we'll see like so far we haven't seen much change or anything that could possibly change anything back to normal but we do have an idea of what might have probably caused the whole switch in the first place so yeah i'm curious to see how it's going to continue but that's all about this episode i hope you enjoyed my reaction so if you did please give this video a thumbs up and if you can see my other reaction videos please check out my channel and subscribe and if you can wait to see my reaction to the next episodes you can already find it on my patreon so if you're interested please go check it out you can find the link in the description box below so in any case thank you all for watching and i'll see you next time bye bye